Hey guys, I'm LB, it is a whopping 36 degrees outside Celsius, and I did not sleep well last night, so obviously it's a great time to play puzzle games, right? Let's check out Monochrome by Tiasu, I mean, Determinated. Fill my eyes with that monochromatic vision. Also, the map's not actually... is it actually black and white? That would be cool if you actually made it black and white in-game, but <laughs> anyway. Cave here, I see you're enjoying these color be gone glasses you got from the brand new Aperture Science Store, or ASS for short. Wait, who made that acronym? I am I the only one? I am the only one with enough smarts around here to do that. Greg, is that you dig giggling in the other room? You won't be laughing when I throw you out on the curb. Don't let the door hit you in the Aperture Science Store on the way out. One of you pencil pushers got the clone we made of Greg and downloaded all his memories up until he made that stupid acronym. Anyway, Back to the shades. Apparently, there is a defect in the plastic around the eyes, making where the glasses stick to your face and can't come off without lethal amounts of industrial solvent. Don't stress out about it, because toxic chemicals can and will leach off the plastic into your skull if you do stress out. Looks like you're stuck with that glorious black and white vision that we all envy. When you look for the handsome devil you usually see in the portal, aka you, he, sh he or she may look different. Less human, more stick figure. Apparently, the glasses inhibit a natural facial recognition, Making it to where you can't recognize yourself. Kind of strange not knowing who you are. Oh well, Cave Jonathan, we're done here. Sorry, I had a lot of trouble reading that because I am very tired right now. <laughs> Normally I'm better at reading. I apologize. But, let us get started. I think that was a long enough introduction. Hey, wait a second, this isn't actually black and white. Not sure you actually could, though. Well, there might be some tricks that I don't know about. There's probably some console commands you can use to make actual black and white, but... Let's see, for now, we have Conversion Gel. Interesting. Oh. Well, that's not very nice! <laughs> what?! You just put a- That's literally the first thing I see when I walk in. I mean, I guess there is technically a warning sign there, way off in the distance, and I have to zoom in to see it. But come on, that's- that's, uh... I don't really like that. <laughs> let's, uh, let's get up- let's get up here, see what we're working with. Even this is dangerous, what the heck? Who designed this? What? Why is there just- This is really dangerous! <laughs> is this just gonna- I guess it is. Alright, well at least we know it auto-respawns. I'm not sure if that's useful information or not. Well, hey, that's better than nothing. Uh... Why is that a thing? Apparently we've got turrets to worry about. Somehow. Let's just get gel on each spot, perhaps. Alright, so now that we've done that... What exactly... What exactly am I supposed to be doing here? How do I get up there? That's a good question, right? That looks like it does something to do with the exit. Yes, I will definitely need to press that button if I'm gonna get to the exit. But how would I even do that? Oh, I thought that might hit the ceiling. That's not quite what I hoped would happen. What does that do for me? Oh, that does allow me to use the light bridge. Okay, well that answers some questions then. Huh. I suppose let's take this off for now, and see how the light bridge... ...does anything for us. Hmm. I don't know, let's- let's just try some stuff. Let's, uh... I don't really know that there's a good way for me to put the cube anywhere safe, is there?
Is there? Is there even a way I can get it to land on the faceplate? Ah, well maybe- maybe I'll just have it auto-respawn for now. Alright, let's see here. Carefully. Should probably save at this point, right? Oh, that's, uh... Ooh, that was close. So I've got that much taken care of. Ooh, that was dangerous. Alright, this works. Not sure... Not sure if this could be the best way. You know, I don't think I've seen this before. I don't know that I've seen what happens when gel collides with overlapping light bridges like this. So the exit is technically open, but there's still turrets we have to deal with, right? Not sure what I did all this for. Not sure what that's for either. Hmm. Well, let's just try the obvious thing. I'm not really sure where the puzzle element comes in yet. Maybe I picked a good map to play when I am tired out of my mind. That's two down. At least. Is the third one down yet? There it goes. What hit it though? I'm not sure what happened there. But, uh, problem solved, I suppose. So. Wait a second. This is not quite how I expected things to turn out. Uh, hmm. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. Careful. I'm not used to having the light bridge come out of the top side of the portal here. So if we head over here, we, we do have the gel here at least. But... Oh, that's, uh... Hmm. Yeah, I'm not- I'm really not used to doing this with a portal like that. Come on. Oh my goodness, this is like... Surprisingly finicky. Alright. Don't need to do anything there. I think we need to, like, launch ourselves up. Oh, I didn't even see that. That makes a lot more sense now that I've seen it. <laughs> we need the cube in here. Oh, I suppose this is easier than I thought it was. Could it really be that simple? I feel like I skipped something. I can't surely- surely it can't be that simple, right? Just get conversion gel in a few places, kill some turrets, and that's it. I mainly did it that way to avoid fizzling the cube accidentally. Is this really all it takes? What? How did... how did that work? What if I just jump in? Will that work? Well... Kind of, maybe? If I can actually jump. There we go. Why was that music not playing before? <laughs> I feel like I skipped something. I don't know- I don't really understand what that was for? Cause without the gel there, I could just... portal out of that to land, grab the cube, then jump into a portal there. I don't know. Not sure... not sure I like this one, to be honest. Alright, well, as always, thank you so much for watching, I really appreciate it, I'll see you all in another video. Goodbye! Remind me to sleep. Sleep is important.